video will show you how to make this super cute pink, dark pink, and white cuff bracelet with the Crazy Loom Rubber Band Bracelet Maker. You'll need to join together four Crazy Looms to make this cuff bracelet. Gather together your pink, dark pink, and white rubber bands, S-clip, and hook. You're ready to start placing. Follow these three easy steps for placing the rubber bands. Place the dark pink along the bottom and along the outer sides. The pink double them up in the middle and all the way up, and then the white you'll create squares going all the way up. Before I give you details on how to do the steps, here's what it will look like when you're done. Place the dark bands as a V on the left and right bottom as you see here. Start with the left and then go to the right. Same thing on the right side. Start with the left band and then overlap with the right band. Now you will take your bands and go up the left side of the loom and then up the right side of the loom. This is what it will look like when you're done placing the dark pink rubber bands. Step two, now you're ready to place pinks. You will place two pink bands per placement all the way up the second column in the middle of each loom, just as you see here. And then do your hand motions just to show that it goes all the way up. This is what your crazy loom will look like when you're done with step two, placing the double pink rubber bands up the loom. Now you're ready for step three, placing the white rubber bands. Make a square of white all the way up the center of the looms, just like you see here. This is what your loom will look like when you're done with step three of placing the white rubber bands. Flip the loom, very important. You will now start picking on the opposite side of the loom that you started placing. Picking, we're going to learn how to pick per row. Once you learn that, you will continue the sequence up the entire loom. Reminder, if you didn't already, remove the two dark rubber bands on the last two pins like you see here.
This is what your crazy loom will look like when you're done picking the loom. Congratulations! Now you're ready to finish it off with a slip knot through the two points shown on the end of the loom. It's time to take your bracelet off the crazy loom. Since this is a wider bracelet, it's a cuff, it might take a little more time than the other style bracelets you have done. So be patient and help the rubber bands come off the loom like you see here in this instructional video. It looks great. You're ready to connect your cuff bracelet and put it on. Congratulations. Hope you had fun.